Greetings comrades and welcome to this episode of Weird Russian News, the best news show from the best country in the world. Let's dive right into it. Kaluga Kebab healed a disabled person in a wheelchair. I heard you were talking shit about Russian medicine? It's only two dollars for an elixir of life. Voice assistant Alec from Tinkoff Bank suggested the client to cut off her fingers. The company explained that he was still studying. What exactly did he study? The human anatomy? So next time he could advise you to cut off your whole arm? Deputy of the Legislative Assembly of the Vologda region opened the memorial plaque in tribute to himself. What kind of people live in Vologda? They can't even make an adequate plug to a person. He has to do everything himself. I hope he had already started to build a monument for one and only amazing human being in this country. To himself. Ukrainian woman complained about the chupacabra hypnotists. What? I believe in chupacabras, but we all know that hypnosis is not... Okay, guys, it's definitely real. A naked Russian escaped from intensive care and went home. Alright, you could say that the care was just a little too intensive for him. Or maybe he just didn't want to miss a new episode of Rick and Morty? A newborn boy was named the Lion King in Moscow region. Well, first of all, where is Rafiki? And isn't it too late for a promo? The movie was in cinemas in July. Also, the parents probably need to remember that there could be only one king in Russia.